Hi and welcome, I am Helle from game for life BG and today I'm going to make a solo playthrough of Canvas Reflections and this is an expansion for Canvas and I will quickly go over what you have in this expansion and then I will just play the game and explain as I play the game. And in this version you get this huge board where you actually have spaces for all of these different tokens and also for these mission cards, you would normally place them this way. I have uh, chosen one of the scenarios they have where we have four of the new cards. In uh, this expansion there are eight new different mission cards and uh, when you're going to play they do recommend that you can shuffle all of them and then take four at random and you will shuffle them also with the base game mission cards so you have even more different missions. But I have chosen for this video to take four of the new mission cards and I have chosen a scenario we can zoom in. I have taken this, what's new, so we have the adjacency, alignment, balance and focus. And we need to get up at 33 points to be able to win this scenario. And uh, normally you would place the board in uh, this way. And then you would place the mission cards like this and you have uh, spaces for all of these different tokens. But for us to be able to zoom in a bit so you are not that far away from the cards and the symbols, then I have set it up like this. And I'm going to play this solo, so I will be playing against Vincent. And we are both going to start with six of these. And uh, in this new version, we have new cards. This is all expansion cards, and this is cards for the base game. So you do need the base game to, place the, to play this uh, version of the game. And uh, there's also one more set of uh, cards with this, with this expansion. Signature style variant where you have some animals and you have some symbols that will double up uh, symbols that are next adjacent to them, but this is not recommended for the solo play. So I'm not going to go through this one. So we have new card. We need to mix in with the original deck of cards and uh, I'll just show you a little bit about what's different. On uh, this one, you do have a little R here so you can uh, take the cards out again when you have mixed them with the normal ones if you want to. And uh, you have on some of the cards, you will see this error. And this means that you can flip the card to the other side. On this side, you have uh, yellow and green. And if we flip it to the other side, then we have green and blue. So, so in that way, you have more to think of when you take the cards. Uh, for you, you can flip them and then the color will change. And then we have some new tokens, the gold. And with this one, you need to uh, place this symbol you have up here. Now this symbol you have here adjacent to it and then you will be able to grab a gold token and they will be worth three points at the end of the game. That is kind of what is new. You have the gold tokens that are worth three points and then you can flip the cards. So that is going to give you even more to think of when you uh, have to grab and make your paintings. In this game we're going to make paintings and we need to, to use three cards to our painting and we can have a max of five cards and then we would have to make a painting. And we need to make three paintings and then we will score points uh, depending on these four cards we have. We have the focus, where we need to have exa exactly three of any of these type of symbols in these colors. And they have to be the same. Always you can look on the back side, there they have a description and also an image. Here they have three of these, adjacent, uh, they have three of these in the colors, the yellow, the green and the blue and uh, they don't have it here, so they are not going to gain it on this side. But here we would be able to gain one. So we have to make sure we have the same kind of symbol in these three colors. And then we have the balance. With this one we need to have equal amount of, uh, of triangles and uh, suns. And on this side we can see we have two triangles and two suns, so they are equal. And here we have none, that is also equal because we just have to have the same amount of them. And then we have adjacency, two pairs uh, of adjacent. So this means that we need to have uh, two, two pairs. So here we have uh, one pair with the suns and one pair with this uh, multicolored. And this one do not count as a set. It has to be two adjacent to each other. And then we have alignment. And here we have to have a triangle left of this symbol. So in this one we actually have two, so we are going to get two tokens 
And on this one, we don't have any because it doesn't count if it, they aren't the same. It has to be to the left on another space. So that is what we are going to go for. And we have to see if we can get up at at least 33 points. So the first thing we need to do is to shuffle the cards. And uh, you should shuffle all of these with the set of cards. And then only place how many you can have in the box because they won't all fit in the box. So you can fill it up and set the other cards to the side. And then we are ready. First we need to get some cards out here. So we're going to uh, draft cards. And we are going to start the game. And uh, we, we, in, on our turn we can take one of these or we can make a painting. But we need to have at least three cards to make a painting. So when I want to grab a card, I, I, if I want any of these two, I can just grab them. If I want any of these, I have to place a token on both of these. And it's my turn first, and then it will be the Vincent's turn after me. And uh, we definitely need some triangles and some suns. I can see on this one we have the triangle, and this one we have a sun. This one we have uh, two triangles and one sun. And what was this? We had uh, this needed the same in these colors. That is the three center colors. If I want this one, I have to place a token on both of these. Uh, and this one will score points for each of these symbols. So this one with these two could be pretty good. Or with that one up there. And we do have a sun on it. Do you know what? I think we're just going to grab this card here. Then we can grab a card. And I will place them up here. And then these we will slide down. And we will take a new card and place here. And then it's going to be Vincent's turn. And for Vincent, we are going to toss all of these. And then for each side he has turning up, then we are going to place one of these cards. And yeah, I'll just show it to you. We will toss them. And he got exactly four, so he's going to place these. And when he has an even number, he's going to take the top card. If he had an odd number, he was going to take this bottom card. So he's going to take this card and it's just going to be discarded. That's the only thing that Vincent is going to do. And this one is going to flip down and then we get a new card up here. Okay, so with this one, we need, we would like to get this one, but I don't think I want to pay a lot for it. And this one scores points per triangle. Here we have a triangle. We need to have equal amount of suns and triangles. I don't, I don't like, I want some other, this one has different colors. We want to get some different colors. This one could also be a thing. Because we score points for these. So I, I would actually like one of these two. And I think at the moment we have one sun, so we need a triangle. If we could get both of these, that could be okay, I think. I think I will go for this one. So I will also place four tokens. So we're going to place four tokens. But what about, what about this one? We want triangles to the left. That one is to the right. So that way, that would be better. Yeah, let's see. Maybe we can grab this one afterwards. No, the triangle. Oh, some of them we would be able to flip. This card we can actually flip to the other side. We can flip it to this side. So it will be over there. Ooh, this is perfect. Because then, when we have to make this one, we can do like this. And then we need to get some triangles on this side. So this one is one of the new cards where we can flip it to this side, or we can flip it to this side. All depending on what we get. Yeah. But we are not going for... We are not going for the one with the three of the same symbols. Ah, we can't do it all. That's the thing in this game, we can't do it all. Okay, and then Vincent is going to toss these two. Wow, so he's going to place them here and take this card. Ah, that was one I was looking at. And you just get the tokens on it when you take a card. So we're going to take these down. 
and get a new card up here. Okay, so three of the same is going to be tough because we are going for this one where we can get uh, two points for each of these tokens. But we have one. Didn't we have? Ah, yeah, that was three. Then we have to have triangles left to these. So if you could get two triangles, we could make this one two times. And then two pairs. We have one pair. If if we had one with two triangles adjacent to each other, but we don't. That that could that could be a good combination. We might want to change what we are doing. Or if we could get a sun or one of these, because we can't flip this one to this side. So if we got a sun or one of these, then we could have two pairs. So if we got, it needs to be this one up here. And then we would have the same amount of suns if we got that one. Yeah, if we got that one. Oh, but we can't. We can't, we can't, we can't, we can't. Oh, but we can take this one. We would have to pay two. Yeah, if we, if we get this one, then we would have two pairs. Two, then we could make one with the, with the two suns, and we have, would have these, and we would have the same amount of suns, and yeah, so we would fulfill three of them. No, two of them. What we would fulfill, we would not fulfill the one with the left. We wouldn't fulfill this one. But we would fulfill this one and this one. Is that good enough? And then we would get some of these. Yeah, I think we, I think we want that one. We, we can see what we are going to go for. We we still we can get the. Five cards in all. So I think we're going to take this one. And then we'll see. But at the moment we could make something like this. Could make something like this. And then we had two pairs. We had the same um, Oh, we don't have the same amount of suns because there's a sun right there. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> it didn't even work. <laughs> oh, we had one too many sun. Maybe we need to do something else then. <laughs> ah, I'd also want to see if we can do more stuff. Hmm. But we still can have two more cards before we decide what we're going to do. Okay, it's Vince's turn. And he got zero this time so he's going to that's a an, a, a, an even amount so he's going to take this card here and get all of these back to himself ah, i didn't think of that there was a triangle wait a minute why oh it's because it was because of the sun it's because of the sun on that one and there's a sun on this one in that case then this one or this one would be better because they don't have the sun on them. Wow, this one has two of these. And it can also be flipped to the other side. I think I want that card. We can do definitely do something with that card. The next time I need to take one of the bottom cards. Because now I have four cards. Because we can flip this to this side. So I got these four cards. So I have more to think of and how to arrange them, but I can only use three, even though I would like to use all four of them, then it would be perfect. Then we would also be able to to do this one. Ah, so we have to choose what we're going to go for on these cards. But first, it's Vincent's turn, and he now has a lot of these. So let's see which card he's going to grab. Now he had an odd number, so he's going to take this card, which we haven't slide it down yet oops so when he has an odd number he's going to take the bottom card and he's going to keep this one so he will just place these tokens and then he's going to take this card so 
So I have to take one of these two. And um, yeah, I think at the moment I will just grab this one so I can get a lot of tokens. So I have more options when I have to choose a card. And then next time I need to make a painting. Then it's Vincent's turn. Let's toss his tokens. He got one. So he's just going to take this card down here. And now we need to... That was one of the gold ones. Mm -hmm. um, okay. So how can we arrange this in the best way? Hmm, yeah, we could also, if we had a thing like this, then we would have two of these and two of these to the left. So that would, we would have made this one two times. Hmm. That is, and then we could, which one, well, if we took this one. No, then I wouldn't want to have that one. Then we would have to have this. If we had this, no. Ah, 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 ah. This one would only bring us two of these and then one of these. So we would get three, three tokens with this one. If if we had these two and then we would need one more card. One more card. What could we do if we had one more? We can't get ooh we can't get the yellow. Then we would have one pair. If we need three of the same symbols in here, that is not a possibility because we would need three triangles and we can't. We can't fulfill that one no matter how we're going to place these but we did have this one where we could score these gold or silver silver tokens but in order to score this one we need some of these then with this one we would have two oh maybe we could do like this oh we need the same amount of suns and triangles. Oh, fulfilling all of this, this is really difficult. I think I will go for the gold ribbon since I have this one. So if you had this, you have this. And then we have this, I think. This is the setup I'm going for. So we have three of these, which we, we're going to take three of these. We can take more. There are more of them, of course. So we get three of these. And uh, we have the same amount of suns. So we're going to get... Uh, one of these. And we have one triangle to the left of any of these. So we're going to get one of these two. So we got five in all. So that was our first painting. You can see it can be very puzzling to figure out how you are going to put them together and what will score you the most points. And in the end, I don't know if this was the right one because I could have had one where I got one of these and two of these. But that is what we are going for, our first painting. So this is called Colossal Curiosity. All right, that took me a, a time. That took some time to figure out what I wanted to put together. But now it is Vincent's turn. Let's see which card he is going to grab. He's going to place two here, and he's going to take this card. 
Okay, so I have a lot of triangles. Perhaps we would be able to make this one, even though it's only one point. Maybe I don't want to go for that one. <laughs> uh, but we need to get some more of these. I definitely want these. And perhaps, yeah, we have to have, we have to have, we could get pairs. If you look at this one, we already have, yeah, actually, if, if we got a triangle in here, a green triangle like this, but then it would cover up that one. No, if we could, if we got that card, we would have four triangles, but then we would only make this one two times and that would be it. No, no, we would, would make this one two times and we would make this one one time. Yeah. And this is, this is a card we can flip to the other side too. I think I'll take this one. I think I'll take this one. Because we can't flip it to this side. And flipping to the other side just brings more options. You have to think of. Okay, let's see. Vincent is going for this one down here okay what are you going to do i would also like to get more of these then i would need this one and that one i can flip to the other side so it's going to be the blue yeah i think i'll take that one can't quite decide but i think i'll take this one Okay, Winton. What is it going to be? He will take this one. Okay, now we have to think. What is the best strategy now? We can't get these two up there. But we can go up to there. We need something with the red, I think. And we have a red and a triangle. So, that one... This is really tough to decide. I think I think I'm just going to go with this one. Well, there's a triangle on it too. And then we have to figure out if we can how we can make something with these. I don't think this is going well at all. If you want the sun next to this one could do like this and then take a triangle like this one I actually think this must be the best I can do it's not perfect but here we get a gold ribbon for a sun adjacent to this one and then uh, I have one of these to the left, so we will get this one, and we have equal amount of the suns and the squares, so we're going to get this one. So I think that is the best we could do in this situation. Yeah, it's 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 uh, difficult to make more than two, I think, with this one. But of course, we are going for some of these. They are also victory points. So that was our second picture. Ah, this is a thinky game, guys. Okay, so I definitely need to go for this one. So we need to have the same amount of suns and triangles because that is seven points up to there. And I would like to do this two times. So if I can get one, so we need to get, yeah, maybe this one or this one so we can get triangles to the left side. Oh, it's uh, not, yeah, triangles. Okay, but it's Vincent's turn. Vincent is going to toss these. He's going to take this one down here. The odd numbers. Oh, but I don't have enough to claim this card. You need to get one of these, because I want to get get this one and I want to get some suns so we need to get some suns but we only get to use free cards to do it so maybe 
this one we can flip and this one can be flipped. And there's a sun in this one too. So I actually think we will go for this card. Where we also have a sun. Or maybe this one. Because oh, we can't flip that card. If we had been flipped this one, then nothing. No, nothing. Didn't matter. Because if we flip this one, then I need to have a triangle here and here. So I need to have a try and this. So these two cards together. But then we wouldn't make the suns. We really want to make the suns too. <laughs> oh, 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 oh! Is there a third card we could use instead? Maybe this one. It also has a sun. Yeah, I think, I think we need to take this card here. Uh, but can we then get that one? We only get to get. You only get to take, because we don't have many tokens, and at the moment we can't afford that one. This one also has a sun, and we can flip it to the other side. I think we need to take this one to get some tokens too, because we can't flip it to this side. We can flip it to this side, then we just need two of these. Maybe we can only get one, and then this one up here. Mm. Yeah, we'll see. Okay, Vincent. Now, Vincent, he may not take one of these two. We don't want him to take any of them. Two? Whoa, that was close. He's going to take... No, not that close. He's going to take this card here. I would have liked him to take that card. Oh, we need actually to put a new card up here too. I forgot that before. And then one here. Okay. Which of these two are we going to take? This is not helpful enough. I think we have to take that one. So I need to spend four of these. Because we can't flip this one and we can't have any of these to the left. So we're going to spend four to grab this one. So we have an opportunity to yeah, to make it. Maybe we also need that one. Ah, we'll see. We'll see. Ah, no, we can't. Eee, I want it all, but I don't think I can. Well. Vincent is going to take a card. Wow. He's going to take this one, the odd. was an odd number. Wait. But anyway, I can only grab a card from these two. And are any of them going to be helpful? Uh, but up, but up, but up. Let us see what we have. So we need to get the same amount of suns and triangles. So I only think I can make this one one time. But what else can we make that could bring us points? Mm. We have sun and triangle, sun and this thingy. Mm. Ooh, maybe, maybe, maybe this one. I think maybe this one. I can't do it better than this, than getting two of these. That is all I can do with this. Oh. Yeah. I might just do it like this then. I can only do it. So I get two. Unfortunately, I would have liked to get more. So I'm not sure we're going to pass this one. 
so we made this one for our third picture and for this one we are going to get we have the same amount of suns and triangles but we only have one to the left so we're only going to get one i would have liked one more of these and we didn't get any of these ah not good i think we have to score our points so we are going to get for the these ones we're going to get 14 points but these one we're going to get eight that's 22 plus three that is 25 plus these six 31 so we didn't manage because we needed to get up at 33 but ah, so close if we had been able to get this one it would have been five points more Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe. Hey, I could have gone for two of these and then not get that one. No, 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 no. It was seven points plus four. No, 11. That's the best. The other one would have been nine points. So 31 points. Nearly meant to make it two points more and we had made it. But... It was close that we could have made this one. We, we did have we did have a lot of these, but the suns, we needed to make that one too. So if we had gotten this one, then we would have had 36 points and it would have been awesome, but we didn't. Alrighty. This was a playthrough and I have... As you could see here, there's a lot of thinking in this game and how to arrange the cards. And the element they have added where you can flip them to the other side, that just brings even more thinking because you have to, there are more ways you can put them together, the cards, than when you can flip them to the other side, as you can see. I have, I have uh, made a, yeah, I will definitely make a, a, a fast speed forward where I'm sitting and thinking a lot. I will give you... I will show some of the process that where I'm thinking to you, but not at all because that would be boring, I think. So I will definitely speed that one up when I make this video afterwards. So if you have played the normal version of the game and you are looking for what the, if you should buy this expansion, then I hope you got an idea of how it works. I will say you get even more of these objective cards and then more ways to uh, to score points for, with these where you can flip them to the other side and brings a lot of more you have to think of and then you also have this one i haven't tried it yet where you have some of these that can double symbols so this would count as two suns if you had a sun with this uh, two times yeah but that was my playthrough it does say it only should take half an hour but yeah if you sit and think then it will of course take longer time uh, to play the game but it is a quick game with the grabbing the cards but Grabbing the right ones and putting them right together so we can score the most points. That can be difficult. I thought it was difficult to make, to combine these with each other. Because, yeah, it just was. But maybe you can make it work even better for you. But that was my playthrough of Canvas Reflections Pie. Okay, guys. So... In the English version, I only got 31 points. After that, I played the Danish version and it went a lot better and in a total different direction. I actually got 38 points in the Danish one. And I will just say that the first one I made was this one, where I had, no, the first one I made was this one, where I had everything. I had these three in the center, so I got one of these tokens. I had the same amount of this triangle and the suns. I had two pairs. It, it could be the same. So I got this one. And then I also had the one to the left. So I got one of these. And I uh, would get uh, a silver token for each of these I had. So I also got that. So in the Danish version, I actually got five tokens in the first one. Just wanted to say that to you guys that... And I will also say that it can uh, the game can be played very different from game to game, depending on the cards that come out here and what you can grab. 